Three, two, one, pull it! Jesus Christ! What up, Rep Pack? It's your boy here, King Reptar, back with another video. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. And if you guys aren't, you know the trail camera flip Rep Pack. It's about to get a whole lot brighter because your boy is here. So today, we have this giant box here. All right, well, what is it? Like a 10 foot long katana or something? No, that's over here. <laughs> <laughs> but it is something okay. absurd and giant. Oh, I... <laughs> so today, guys, I have been, oh, you guys, as you guys know, I always am looking for ridiculous and crazy stuff that I think you guys have never seen before. Just so we can have fun with it and boy, do we. <laughs> today, I actually have something super special. I got it up from a guy on Opera that actually has a bar and this was actually a display in his bar for over 20 years. Oh, that's sweet. Yeah, and he just was like, hey, you want this giant baseball bat? And I was like, yeah, I want that giant baseball bat. <laughs> so he sent it over and that is in his box and I have some great, great, the, the most important news, really. One second. Are you ready for the news? Yeah. <laughs> Did you get another one or are you, is, that, is that the original? It, did you get another one or is that, or is that the, did you find it? This is the original! This is the original? Found you found it. it? What was it? I'm sorry, you didn't steal it. <laughs> I know. <laughs> the unboxing knife was actually in my pants. I found it in the laundry. It was actually in a pair of pants and I didn't realize. So it got cleaned in your locker, laundry machine got wrecked? Yeah, <laughs> a little bit too. I'm gonna go inside and unbox this real quick just so Parker can't see it. Just for the sake of Parker not being able to see it. Oh, I like, you know, <laughs> <laughs> your things being uh, not given to me like that. <laughs> So let me go in there real quick, guys, and I'll bring the bat out. Your mind is going to be blown. Okay, I thought you were going to blow my mind. I, like, I don't think I want that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm bringing the bat. You want to see it? Yeah. All right, turn around. Oh. I need to get over there. Yep, please. Can I turn, 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 around, turn around? Okay, turn around. okay. You got me? Okay, I'm here. This is the top of the bat. <laughs> oh, my God. Here is the giant. <laughs> God. Baseball bat. <laughs> so this right here, guys, oh my God. is a giant limited to 100. There is literally, this was made 20 years ago, and there is very limited of them left, and we got one. <laughs> That's awesome. Like, and it's a Louisville slugger. It's a legit baseball bat. Like, it's all wood. This is yeah, a real a girthy. Dirt. Uh, this is disgusting. That's the most disgusting. <laughs> I can't just molest a mandingo. <laughs> this is out of your league, okay? You don't molest this thing. <laughs> Louisville, Kentucky, made in the USA. Even when it's giant, it's made in the USA. I think Power Eyes, this is what they added for the labeling. Power Eyes. I think that's an understatement. <laughs> this is an actual wood bat, guys. We are going to be testing this thing out today. Imagine you, were in a, you open your first pack of baseball cards and you saw the first guy in the card is just this guy. <laughs> Mom, why'd you buy me these clown cards? <laughs> okay, so we're gonna be testing this out, guys. But I need your guys' help in the comments down below. What else do you guys want to see with this baseball bat? I'm thinking line exit. Oh my god. <laughs> and I'm not joking, you guys. These things are like $700. Put a listing on screen. King Reptar's wall is gonna be, gonna be very uh, completed. <laughs> Let's get the testing of the giant baseball bats. All right, guys. So we're gonna be doing a lot of different tests, including some giant fruit baseball swings with this thing. But this door right here, this is actually a door. I got locked in the bathroom, had a little bit of a panic attack, I had to break out, so. Oh my god. <laughs> but this right here, I ended up making into a throwing knife board after I did that, so then basically now it's the door. Oh, so that wasn't you, okay. Uh, well, that wasn't me scratching at the door for two weeks. Oh, okay. Or anything. So what we're gonna do, because I have nothing else to do with this door, what we're gonna do is we're gonna see what would happen if you had a giant baseball bat and you needed to break down a door. I, I couldn't be more curious. Let's do it. Anybody in there? Yeah. What are you doing? Taking a sh**. Still taking a sh**? Yeah. Well, you're gonna have to hurry up. We got customers waiting. I'm at my, I'm at home. <laughs> this is my house now. What you customers? See this baseball bat. This is the key to your house now. I'm breaking down your bathroom. I'm not done Three, wiping. Two. I gotta one. wipe. Oh Jesus! You Giant just... baseball bat. <laughs> Three, two. Oh no no no. What else do you want me to bring up? This table? This no, hall? Table. This house? You no, know, the walls. <laughs> no, no, that's, that's really expensive repairs. I don't care. <laughs> Boom! This is incredible. All right, guys. So we're going to be testing it right now. And dude, just look at, look at that. Oh, my God. <laughs> it's going to be ridiculous. I'm going to try and sideswipe it or go straight down. What do you think? Straight down. Straight <laughs> you down. You know what? Why don't you try it? Okay, I, I oh. really want you to try it so you can just feel like you feel like maybe like Babe Ruth. Yeah. Like Parker's going to try this All one right. out. All right. <laughs> Let's see what happens. You know, the thing the thing about battle is bat versus bat. This is a different battle. This is Parker trying not to hurt himself. <laughs> That's a battle I fight every day and lose. <laughs> All right, so here it is. Parker versus a giant jar of cracks. So here we <laughs> I sounded like my last night. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> Wait, these are pickles. My, my, my bad. I just saw dill. All right, here we go. Giant baseball bat. This whole thing looks so ridiculous right now. <laughs> you look like a cartoon character. <laughs> like, <laughs> uh, 
No, like Boomerang in the 90s. <laughs> Did people make references to me that are kind of obscure? No, not anymore. They did in 2007. Man, I get nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Three, two, one, hit it. Oh! <laughs> Jesus Christ! You know what? It's a good thing we put that tarp down. I got glass in my face. It smells like Lindsay Lohan's. <laughs> I didn't even say the joke yet. <laughs> I'm like, that's just me. <laughs> trying to live her life. Dude, you smushed this. <laughs> what the? <laughs> smash this. That's the bill. That's Parker. He can smash three <laughs> in one second. <laughs> wait, 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 what? All right, guys. So for the next thing for this height and this portable piece of thunder, is <laughs> this metal container right here, guys. So basically, you guys have seen the metal test before. It's a test how much impact is going down on something. But this is a giant one because we have a giant bat. So underneath here, we have a watermelon. The goal is to see if we can destroy that watermelon through this container. All right, you ready? Oh, yeah. I'm gonna get a running start. Wait, you don't even need it. I do need it. I'm gonna happy Gilmore this. Three, oh, no. two, oh, no. Oh, no. one, hit it! Oh, my God. So there was a lot of damage. I'm not sure if it actually hit the melon. It's shaped <laughs> like the bat. <laughs> Granted, it's not the best damage we've seen, but yeah. that that's a metal Look at how container. thick that is. It had to go through all four sides. It literally turned this thing into a goddamn Tech Deck half pipe. <laughs> you know, man, shout out back to the old days. I, I was like, man, that's a good idea. But you know what? <laughs> Don't you warn me about these things. What the heck? Oh. Next, guys, we're going to be doing the juice buster. The goal is here is to pop every single one of them open. We got all five different flavors here. I'm not going to lie, dude. Something about using this bat, you just feel wrong. You know, like when Thanos got the Infinity Gauntlet at the end of Endgame, and you're like, you know, he's not supposed to win. Like, it's over already. How did he, how's he going to get again? <laughs> That's how I feel like with this bat. Like, just something's not fair. Three, two, one. Oh! <laughs> oh, and it runs no, red. That's the color I like to see. Oh wow, that's rainbow that's, sherbet, that's, baby! So oh my! Right here, we got a fruit cocktail. You want some? Come on, Bart. You know you want no, some. I do not you want know you want some. You know you. I don't want any of that. I know you want lemonade, grapefruit punch, and also mango. <laughs> Let's move on to the next test. Oh, God, that was that was very sticky. That's what she said. <laughs> oh yeah, she still hasn't gotten up. She's stuck to the ground. Oh, that's, oh. <laughs> All right, Jimmy. It's the first day. It's game day. Are you ready? No, you're not ready, Jimmy. But you better be ready. There's some big boys. There's some big bats, Jimmy. Why are you sweating, Jimmy? You shouldn't be sweating, Jimmy. Everybody's depending on you. If we lose this game. It's. <laughs> Jimmy. All right, guys, so we're going to be testing this right now. So the goal of a baseball helmet is to protect you from baseball injuries, like a bat hitting you, more like a baseball hitting you. It is to protect you when playing baseball. So we're going to see, could a baseball helmet protect you from the world's largest baseball bat, though? <laughs> Are you ready, Jimmy? Because we're coming down hard, Jimmy. Three, two, one. Make daddy proud, Jimmy. Oh, my God. Daddy proud and what? You in the need afterlife? Skin, Jimmy. You played one inning and your head blew up, Jimmy. Here's the rest of Jimmy. You know, it's, it's, <laughs> you know it's, it's the funny part is that, you know, the, you know, the helmet's fine. <laughs> yeah, the helmet's fine. If the situation was the same, this entire front piece bent in and literally exploded Jimmy's head. Jimmy's baseball career. I mean, it was it was over from the start because he sucked, but <laughs> it's really over now. I guess it was the bottom of the ninth. <gasps> oh my lord. I'm wearing Jimmy's face. So I mean, that's from that brain, Jimmy. <laughs> Hey, I just learned algebra. <laughs> Jimmy Uchiha! All right, guys, so now the gloves, the gloves are literally and figuratively on. So what we're gonna be doing now is we're gonna be doing real life giant baseball. Oh, like, okay, all right, all right. We're gonna be eating a literally absurdly large, like watermelon this big with this giant bat. Parker's gonna be pitching it to me. I'm literally gonna be slugging him clean out of the air, all trying right. to see how good of a hitter I can be with a bat that's literally as almost as tall as me. All right, so uh, what's your team? Who, 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 what team are you on? I'm my own team. Team Rep Pack for life, baby. Pretty long name. Yeah, okay. <laughs> you know, you go with like the Pirates or the Mets. <laughs> Three, two, one. Swing. Oh! Oh! oh my god. I said it's a home run. Dude, that was so hard to swing. That literally. Okay. okay. <laughs> Did you see that can't run back? No, he did dirty, man. You know what? Sometimes you might be dirty. Get your hand out of here. Sometimes you might be dirty. But you know what? When nobody else is there to pull you up, you gotta stand on two feet and you gotta stand up your goddamn. <laughs> Three, two, one, pull it! Oh! oh, that was a slugger! <laughs> oh my god! The thing is, you see the melon coming, and then you see the bat go, and then you see something happen, and then everything's gone. It literally is like a car accident. It's like witnessing <laughs> a train wreck. Alright, let's move on to a little bit of two different targets. Three, two, one, pull it! Oh! <laughs> Dude, that, that was, was a 
was a good hit. I'm getting pretty good with this giant baseball bat. I might hey, join the MLB. GMLB, Giant Major League Baseball. If you guys are looking for anybody, your boy's here. Let's see if you can handle this. <laughs> oh, the same thing. Three, two, one, pull it. Oh, oh, oh. God. I am getting legendary with this. I am also giving you pitches that you cannot not hit. It's, it's a combo work, man. It's a combo work. <laughs> Giant MLB, again. If you need a fruit slinging motherfucker, you got him right here. Super celestial smoother. Your boy. If you need somebody that can beat the shit out of anybody named Jimmy, your boy. Your other right boy. here. Your boys. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next up is a honeydew. Three, two, one. Oh! Oh, I gave you a curveball on that one. All right, now let's try it on a harder target. Let's try if we can see if we can do it with a, a coconut. Three, two, one, pull it. Oh! You broke it! <laughs> that thing is absolutely insane. It's just light enough to, for you to be able to swing the bat, but just heavy enough to just blitter anything it touches. Look at that. That's a look of disbelief. Yeah. And he's not even looking at the bat. He's looking at my prank currently. <laughs> no. Oh. This buddy? Yeah. Does all right. All right, so next up, we're gonna be doing on this water jug. This thicker, thicker than a damn snicker. We're gonna go ahead and do that one. Let's do, we gotta clean this tarp up somehow. Three, two, one, pull it. Oh! I think you just blessed the rains down in California. We have hit many of these jugs with many a thing. And they, and they often burst from both blunt impact. This may be the first time where something was almost literally separated from pure impact. That is literally, like I said, a car accident being witnessed. Just boom! Three, two, one, hit it! I feel like I just got really good tickets for SeaWorld. <laughs> okay, now we're doing the rotten milk in my fridge, which based on how much water got has gotten on me, I'm gonna smell worse than I already do. Wait, I have an idea. <laughs> Maybe you should have done the milk and then the water. That's a great idea. Now, after I'm soaking wet in water. So rotten milk, you may be wondering how, why doesn't he just drink the milk that's in his fridge? That's because I always try and start, you know that thing you start with, oh, I'm gonna be healthy, and then you start and you're like, oh, this is hard. <laughs> and then you're like, oh, I'm gonna drink soda instead. All right, three, two, one, hit it. You can't just compete with a bat like this. Yeah. That got all up on you. You know what? At this point, I think every substance possible has been all up on me. <laughs> all right, so now we're we'll doing this watermelon right here, a slightly bigger one. My abs have been crunched. I feel like I have been doing bow flex for six months. Like, this it's is the ab workout I've ever been one. All right, guys, so for this one, I'm gonna have to literally spin around and hit it because there's no way I'm having enough velocity to break this thing and with the much weight as I have to pull. So here we go. All right, pull it. You did it! <laughs> I did do it! The giant bean. As always, flick the bean. And then we gotta throw it. <laughs> Three, two, one, pull it! Oh. Oh. Three, two, one, pull it! Oh. Okay, so that was a lot harder to throw that watermelon than we thought it was gonna be. I think I still got a pretty decent swing in there. Yeah, yeah, that was pretty good. Now, we're gonna move on to the next test. All right, so now we're just going for the extra test. We're doing the cinder block test. This is just wrong. This is very <laughs> wrong. I'm just gonna tip it off my shoulder, go straight down. I don't think it's gonna take much more than that. All right, three, two, one. Swing for him, baby. <laughs> What have you done? No! I just broke seven around. What have you done? At what cost? All right, guys, so the cinder block broke, but so did my heart. <laughs> and your $700. Yes, and my $700. Can we see what this is made out of? What even is this, dude? This is like styrofoam. Like it's coming out like nothing. That's that is not, like, yeah. that that's is not wood. It's like honeycomb. What I could do, guys, like I said, if you guys want to see it, I could give this bat again, and maybe if I wrapped it in Linex, this wouldn't happen. Like maybe if it was wrapped in complete Linex, there's no way to be able to break it. That's what the whole point of Linex is, right? Want to see that? Let me know down below. But as always, Rep Pack, I'll see you guys in the next video. Check out this video right here. Which is actually the last episode where you used something large and disgusting, which was Zabuza Sword. It was actually a freaking giant Zabuza Sword, real life size. Check that video out, guys. I'll see you beautiful people over there. And as always, Rep Back, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bloop!